is up you guys and welcome back to my channel why am i not in center there you go i i literally know how to how to start this vlog and i and i just don't know how to start it our bananas are very 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 ripe so i feel like if we don't make banana bread we are gonna waste them Ooh, we're gonna make chocolate chip banana bread chocolate banana bread chocolate chip chocolate banana we're just gonna make some banana bread with some chocolate chips on top okay so i have this cookbook well this huge recipe book that we've been having since i was like before i was born i was i'm assuming banana, banana walnut bread we're gonna do that sorry chris i know you don't like nuts but we're gonna make it with nuts Banana nut cake. Okay, here we go. This is the right one. Right there. Betty Crocker. We love Betty Crocker. So we need flour, sugar, bananas, shortening, which I'm gonna use oil because I don't want shortening. Nuts, buttermilk. I believe buttermilk you do regular milk and lemon. Baking powder, baking soda. Oh, we don't have baking. Do we have baking soda? We do. Do we have baking powder? We do. Okay, we good. Salt and three eggs. Oh, I'm running low on eggs. I gave you food just now. <laughs> they associate the fridge with veggies, and I opened the fridge for milk and eggs, and they just want lettuce again. <laughs> These are not large e large eggs. These are not large, so I'm gonna add another one, which is an actual large one. So it's gonna be very banana-y. That's fine. That's fine. I wanted to first. I don't know why I wanted to do this, but in my Animal Crossing, my island, I got so bored with my island that I kind of decided to knock it down and restart. Well, not really. I didn't. I didn't want. I'm not gonna knock it down and like restart it completely. But like, I was kind of bored of how it looked, kind of how my villagers are. So my villagers, I would say they're like in a gated community altogether, and I kind of got tired of it. And yeah, I'm gonna. I'm starting to move them all over my island. And my amiibo cards finally came in. I don't think they're like official amiibo cards because they are very very small but they still work and they still give me the character so i'm not complaining and it's like a, a set of like 12. okay so the main reason why i wanted to get those that like set was because they have marshall they have marshall stitches fauna lucky and whitney but what i hate is that i accidentally not accidentally i like let him go i let go of my jock but I got meringue out of it, so I don't know if that's like a good one. It was Bam. He was like a, a blue deer or a blue reindeer, I don't know. And I kind of regret it. And I don't have a jock anymore. The only the only kinds of villagers I have in my island are now lazy, normal, and snooty. Oh, I think this is a lot of banana. <laughs> oh well. I'm gonna try my best to hunt for Bam again. If not, probably Eric. I think Eric is a normal deer. I'm not entirely sure, um, but I just need a job. And I think for my smug village, I'm gonna bring in Marshall. Or we shall see what happens. Also, I've been trying my best to like make my island look very aesthetically pleasing. I don't have a lot of materials. I don't know if you guys understand me. If unless you play Animal Crossing, then cool. But I've been wanting to get the big mushroom lamps, and I don't have it. And also, they have like little. Hi, hi, I don't know if I'm saying that right. The little lamps. Yeah, I kind of want my island just to look nice at nighttime as well. So I need more little lamps and stuff like that. Oh, those big moons and like the star crystals lamps thingies. I don't know. I know Celeste gives them to you. But, like, I don't know where or when. Oh, I need to turn this on. Oh, I needed to make the buttermilk. I don't know how many. I'm just gonna like wing it. 
Well, it says here buttermilk two thirds of a cup. So, one, two, add some lemon to make some buttermilk. How much lemon? I don't really know. I'm gonna say that much. Cool. About everything. What was I grabbing out of here? When I tell you that my my memory is kind of bad, it's really bad. Oh, there's pumpkin seeds. I'm gonna add some pumpkin seeds. There is no chocolate in here. Oh, there is. We'll just throw it all in there. Dry ingredients. How much flour? Two and one third. Cool. Okay, so I put baking powder, baking soda, one and a quarter teaspoon. One and a quarter teaspoon. I get salt, three quarters of a teaspoon. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, I've been wondering. Do you guys want to know like a? Do you guys want me to do like a video of how? Um. Oh, cinnamon. I swear I have like some sort of ADHD or something like that because I get distracted very easily. Do you guys want a video of how I kind of like recovered from wisdom teeth like surgery and how, how it is? Yeah, so I don't know if I completely said how I recovered, but I just want to know if you guys want to see a full video of what you expect in wisdom teeth surgery and how to recover and all of that stuff. But yeah, let me know about that video. Okay, we're gonna add some cinnamon because I forgot about the cinnamon. So, this one for some reason, this recipe doesn't tell you what to throw in with what. So I'm hoping I'm throwing in the right stuff with the right ingredients. One and two thirds. We're gonna add the oil. You're gonna add three eggs. Okay, I, I swear I used to be really good at cracking eggs. Lately, since I started turning vegetarian, I don't know how to crack the eggs. I always thought I was gonna be vegan, but to be honest, my skin has gotten a lot better since I went vegetarian. A little tea. A lot of vegans that were in the YouTube community, or like the bigger ones, turned vegetarian, or they actually started eating meats. But to be honest, not every diet is for people, for everyone. I thought it was for me. I would actually go to a dermatologist and they would give me, they gave me aldactone, and those were basically hormonal pills so my acne would be better but every time I would stop my acne would come back and that's what I hated I did not want to rely on a freaking pill for healthy clear skin I first went vegetarian mainly to see if certain hormones in in dairy or like egg would help with my knee it kind of helped a little bit my knee doesn't hurt as much anymore before it would always hurt whenever I like would run or walk but yeah my knee just always killed me i always got headaches i always broke out even without doctor to be honest and now i believe the egg helps with my skin a lot i, I guess i would rather be vegetarian than eat full on meat again just eating meat is just weird for me so we did the flour we did the sugar bananas oil buttermilk <laughs> damn i almost put out the buttermilk See, you got chunky, that's what you want. You want the buttermilk to be chunky. Ew, that's gross. You know, like in the beginning of quarantine, all of the YouTubers started making banana bread. I kind of want to know what started the whole thing. Like, did somebody just want to make banana bread and then out of nowhere, people were just like, I'm gonna do what she did and make banana bread. Because for me, my, ban my bananas got super, super ripe. Yeah, we're gonna have to switch it. Come on, get up, get up, get your piece out of there right now. Okay. Also, please don't judge me on how dirty this is. I know how dirty it is. Um, I use it a lot. Okay, that is perfectly mixed. Now, what we gotta do I don't know if I want to put the chocolate chips only on top or put some inside, um, but we gotta mix up the. We gotta smash these guys. Please. 
It's like a workout on time. Okay, it's gonna be so weird vlogging with this one now because it just, it's different now. I don't know, I'm not used to this one anymore. I finished smashing all the nuts and I'm just gonna throw it into our batter. I like the nuts a little bit more on the thick, like bigger chunks instead of like very small grinded ones. So yeah, there are some that are still not completely smashed like this almond and others that are like tiny, tiny, but yeah, it's gonna be good. Okay, we're gonna, so we're gonna use this one. I've seen a lot of people use like an actual loaf one, but I use one that is a pan. I don't put that pan stuff on it. Just oil does a trick. See what I did there? Super good. I'm so weird right now. Why am I so weird? <laughs> I know I love summer, but I really, really, this is making me crave fall right now. And then my mom bought some like cinnamon, cinnamon and clove bath and body work, like little plugins. It just, it just gave me the fall vibes. And I don't know how I feel about that because it's barely June. And I kind of found some fall. I don't know, I'm so weird. We're gonna use lots of this chocolate. No. <laughs> I could have touched a spider in that one. That should have just gushing in my mouth. No, 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 no. This one is good. Oh god. Okay, we won't talk about the chocolate because this is definitely not healthy at all whatsoever. It doesn't look that much right now, but when it rises, it's gonna look beautiful. I think people are saying chef's kiss right now. Chef's kiss? Sh sh what? Chef's kiss. Chef's kiss. Yes. We're gonna put that in there. Currently 11.45, we're gonna leave that in there for 40 to 50 minutes, so literally 45 minutes. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and clean up, wash all the dishes, clean the counters, clean the kitchen now, and I'll see you guys in 45 minutes to see how the banana bread looks like. Okay, 45 minutes is up, let us see. Ooh, that looks good. Okay, I need to see if it's ready though. Oh my god, that looks so good. Let's see if it is ready. Yes, okay, that's fine. That is ready. Oh my god. I know! Look, look, look at this deliciousness. Focus! Okay, there we go. That looks so good. I'm probably just acting like this because I'm really, really hungry and I'm just waiting for this to cool off a little bit so I could eat it. But like, I love just like eating the banana bread like that, but it, it literally just came out. So I cannot eat it right now. Half an hour, just cooling off just a tiny smidge because I still like it warm. But yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that. It looks really good. Like I just, oh, I'm just gonna eat a piece of right here. I never actually put almonds in it. So we'll see how the taste is comparing it with just the walnuts. But yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, I still don't like how this thing focuses on me, but it's fine. Okay, taste test. I'm a banana bread. Okay, okay. Mm. I say okay too much. Mmm. It's actually really good. It's not that sweet, but it's very moist inside. So it's like... Just perfect. Just kiss. <laughs> <laughs> You're about to bite into a big old almond right there. I saw your picture and she was like, oh, look, you made brownies? I'm like, no. She didn't. 
Mm. And banana bread. You didn't even say if it was good or not. Oh, that's good. Yeah? You like it? Would you eat it with the nuts? Because I know you don't like nuts in it. No. Mm -hmm. mm, I like it with the almond. Let's go with the almond. I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. I'm going to finish my banana bread and go work out. So, I hope you like this video. If you want to see more, go ahead and like, subscribe, and then turn on the post notification so you know when I upload. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye.